What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Devin back with another reaction video. Uh, this time we are doing What We Do in the Shadows Season 4, uh, Episode 1. And uh, I am really excited for this. This is one of my favorite comedies on TV right now, uh, currently airing. Based on one of my favorite movies of all time, uh, What We Do in the Shadows. Uh, the series uh, stars my favorite Englishman, Matt Berry, who uh, is just hilarious in everything I've seen him in. And then also, he's really a very talented musician as well, along with a cast, an incredible cast of uh, other actors. Uh, notably, Christian Shaw has kind of gotten a, a pretty uh, substantial role, or her role has increased in regularity uh, over the last season. So, uh, from what I can tell, I think she's going to play a pretty big role in this season. Um, but everybody in this show is fantastic. Last we left off, all of our vampires were kind of going in their separate directions. Nandor was trying to find himself because he just got out of a cult that believed you could revert back to human, which was all a sham. But he felt a little duped. He felt lost. He actually tried to go into the Great Slumber, uh, but it was interrupted by Colin Robinson's death. So then he decided to go on this great journey, and he actually decided to take Guillermo along with him. And Guillermo, uh, he promised once they got to where he was going, he would make Guillermo a vampire, which is something Guillermo has wanted since the beginning of the series. So that was very exciting. However, you know, Colin Robinson died, and uh, Laszlo knew this was going to happen, so he had spent the whole last season kind of trying to make Colin Robinson's life, like, a little more exciting, trying to give him, like, the best time he could, because he knew what was coming, and then, uh, as he was getting ready to leave for, I believe, London with Naja, he discovered something, uh that he wasn't expecting, which was a baby uh, version of Colin Robinson crawling around in the basement. So he decided to stay back, and in his steed, he threw Guillermo into a coffin and <laughs> nailed it shut and forced him to go with Naja as her bodyguard. So um, everybody kind of split up at the end of last season. I Obviously, I think we're going to see them all come back together based on the, the title of this episode, Reunited. But I am very much looking forward to this. Uh, so, uh, I'm not really going to ramble anymore. I'm just going to go ahead and get on into this because this is, uh, like I said, this is one of, if not my favorite comedy airing right now. They, uh... If you ask the Academy in charge of, like, the Emmys and stuff, they'd tell you Barry is a comedy, in which case that would be my favorite comedy. But Barry, to me, does not feel like a comedy, especially after what's happened in the more recent seasons. So this, to me, is, I think, the funniest comedy uh, on air right now. So definitely looking forward to uh, some laughs here. And, uh, yeah. If you enjoy this video, please go ahead, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Helps me out, helps the channel. I'd greatly appreciate it. And without further ado, we'll just go ahead and get on into this. Damn, nobody's been home for a whole year. Place is just sat abandoned. Tell a cot a backsplash would make a great accent. I guess he's there, but load bearing wall. Was a load -bearing wall. Why does it look like that? Apologies to you, Brad. What the? Yeah, that's a pretty nice TV. Hello there. Long time no see. Come on in, but keep it down. Okay. I found it. This is the only thing that'll lull him to sleep. Since Naja and Nandor departed, ah, it's been ah, just ah. me and the lad. I don't want to call him Conny <laughs> Robinson, even though he did crawl out of the chest cavity of the deceased Conny Robinson. He really is his own little man, and I'd like to keep it that way. I love the uh, 
outro song. Where the hell did you come from? Well, I had a little hell. Ha 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 Day of your absence oh, has come like so a decade, much. every decade a century. Let's fuck. These guys are... Ha 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 Speak of the devil. Hello, is that you, little one? Not that's not him. Home. Are you sure? Yes, that's a raccoon, my darling. Ha 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 Himself is upstairs asleep. Well, perfect then. Yeah. I want to peel you like a potato and mash your insides. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Before we go upstairs, I have a little surprise for you. It'll wait. Come on! Well done! <laughs> what an entrance! <laughs> it's a saying from the olden days that I learned on my travels. I don't know what it means, but I like how it sounds. Yeah, well, it's a great story. <laughs> They have missed you, and it feels really good to be back in the house. Is he dead? I'm okay. Is no. he dead? Okay. There's a very strong smell of gas leak down here. <laughs> Someone throw me down the lit candle, and I can find my way out. <laughs> <laughs> Don't throw him a lit candle. My eat, pray, love journey. Where to begin? As fate would have it, I got as far as Fresno, I think it is called. I met a very plump family on the train from Wisconsin. I plan to train them, but... Oh, hey there, Nandor. You want to come see the Packers ball in the frozen tundra of the Lumbar field? Something like that. The love and the affection that this... The goth kid. <laughs> I hitched a ride on the ship, and after I drained all the crew, we ran into a little delay. A traffic jam on one of the most important waterways in the world. The Suez Canal was blocked on Tuesday when a very large container <laughs> carrier got... Finally, I found my... <laughs> oh, wow. Look at you. <laughs> Fortifying good judgment, important literature, or colorful shit. Make your choice. <laughs> No! <laughs> and of course, electroshock therapy. Again. Paw Patrol? Calm this down, my darling. I'm not sure this city can take it. This city uh, has taken surgery with all love. Are you okay? You want me to throw you down the candle? Fuck me! Okay, here I go. <laughs> <laughs> Drown me, my darling. It's hot, yeah? <laughs> Where is Guillermo? It collapse at any moment, eh? You ain't tough. Careful, old chap. There's a hole there. What is that thumping? It's just bad pipes. It'll pass. I had to. No, it's probably Guillermo. It's true. I do wish Guillermo was still here. At least he kept the house tidy and ship shape. Who's he talking about? Guillermo. Who? You know, Guillermo. It doesn't matter how many times you keep saying it. It's about this tall, classy. <laughs> I don't think he was that. Sh I have got a teensy little present for you both Ooh. now. Ooh. Okay, don't get. Oh, I thought it was Guillermo at the door, but it's Guillermo in a fucking box. Ta -da! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that guy! Oh, that guy. <laughs> okay, something is happening now. I think he's going to make a poop in his knickers. Uh, that always about to uh, cry. Guillermo, if you want to cry, that's fine. But he might kill you. He is like a badass vampire hunter. You're dead to me. Ah. You're dead to me. Uh, You're dead to me. The fuck did I do? <laughs> Technically, we're all already dead, so. <laughs> that is not helpful at this particular juncture. Oh, shit. Is he dead? Damn, Nandor jumped in there for him with a quickness. Oh, agreed. Charming. That's better. Nandor might uh, care about Guillermo a little bit more now than he used to, because, yeah, he jumped in there with a fucking quickness. Which, good, it's about time. Guillermo hasn't been getting the respect he deserves around there, and 
He could kill them pretty easily. I've had a lot of time to think about my life lately while I was nailed inside a shipping crate for two weeks. <laughs> I gotta start looking out for number one. That that would be me. In this case, I'm, num I'm number one. Goddamn right, Guillermo. Glass of water, please. Glass of water coming up. I know that you want to leave, Guillermo. You feel disrespected. Much in the same way you disrespected me by leaving Don't drink that, Guillermo. Station in New Jersey with my dick in my hand. That wasn't my fault. Agree to disagree. What the fuck is that? <laughs> the chest cavity of Colin Robinson's dead body after he died. Why does it have a lit candle on its head? It could catch on fire, it catches whole place on fire. Ah, there he is. Yes. I found him! <laughs> No, my darling, I don't know what you've got out there, but he's in here. Oh, okay. Never mind. It's just another raccoon. <laughs> okay. Now, I have a little boy who needs feeding. There you are. You like these, don't you? Count Chocula? Hell yeah. <laughs> no. Now sit. Stay, boy. <laughs> 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 so, Guillermo has made a good point hmm. that we should probably make some concrete steps into fixing this house. Engineer, a team of contractors and at least two plumbers. Guillermo said that we're gonna need the structure. Yeah, we heard him. Right there. Right. Guillermo has decided that he's no longer talking to you both because of the bad way you have treated him over the last 12 years. Oh. A bit of sass from the bar. <laughs> <laughs> to fix this house, we need money, correct? Does anyone know if we have any money? Anyone? Uh... Cash, coin, moolah, gold, wonga, rubles, milk, lettuce, bread, dough, sweet cream, stripper tips. Anyone? Co stripper tips. I do have Colin Robinson's automated teller machine card, uh -huh. but what I don't have, I'm afraid, is Colin Robinson's automated teller machine card password. Hey. <laughs> Any ideas? You can't be that stupid, can you? Just give me that. Ooh. This boy's grabbed some claws. <laughs> hey, buddy, do you know the password to this card? Three. Three. Can we get a, a piece of paper and pen? Yes. Good job. Very my good. Queen, my queen. So three. Three. Yeah. What else? Three, yes. One. 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 Hang on. Four. 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 Anything else, Colin? One. 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 This is quite miraculous. This is gonna keep going. Four. Yeah. <laughs> One. Zero. Two. At least I tried. Bloody waste of time. <laughs> I mean, he could still be. He could still be an energy vampire because he's. Like fucking with them and just like listing numbers, which could be pretty boring. Although they looked like they were more into it because they need that pin, but. I could be a very good money maker, opening up our own vampire nightclub. Oh yes, a great idea. A what? A vampire nightclub, like in the film Blade, with the blood sprinklers <laughs> and the live FNS show. It Sometimes you do need to use your special voice to be heard. I was too afraid to use mine in the vampire council meetings, and I deeply regret that. Unless anyone has anything else, I think we can. If I could, I have prepared a little pitch. Another way we could possibly go with our five-year plan. <laughs> I have just two words for you. Vampire nightclub! <laughs> I just really want to open a vampiric nightclub. I mean, come on. It's a no-brainer. Okay. Thank you for your time. And so that is when I decided to quit the Worldwide Supreme Vampiric Council and come home. Okay, this is ridiculous. You're all vamp- Oh, she quit. Can you tell it? No! Completely quiet. Oh, oh, I'm shit. telling you, we are going to open a vampire nightclub. Any questions? Works for me. Fine and uh, 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 this boy. What? What? <laughs> we'll do it. Oh. There you are. Oh, shit. What the hell are you doing? Just sitting here, waiting for you guys to come back? For a year. What? A year? <coughs> oh, wow. Yes, I was just so afraid if I got up, that would be the moment you would come in. Ha 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 ha. 
birthday. Mm. Well, <laughs> we have a lot of council business to catch up on, huh? Actually, no. No more business as usual. Mm. Change of direction? Oh, that's something I really enjoy. I'll tell you what it is. Uh. Okay. We are uh. opening a motherfucking vampire nightclub, baby! <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Here. Yes. No. Yes, we are opening a vampire nightclub. And if any of you motherfuckers get in my way, you will surely live to regret it! Holy shit! <laughs> Alright, well that was uh, episode one of season four. <laughs> Looks like we're opening up a vampire nightclub. Definitely uh, nice to have the gang back together. A lot of just kind of recapping, catching up with where they've been over the last year. And of course, Guillermo falling back into the same trap. Although he claims he's looking out for number one now, but yeah, it just seems like everything's kind of leading him back to being their familiar, basically. But yeah, definitely, uh, definitely a good, a good opener. Looking forward to episode two to see uh, what happens with the nightclub maybe i'm hoping maybe we'll see some familiar faces show up at the nightclub like you know nick kroll's character uh, maybe uh one or two of the guys from the movie we have seen them before so it's not out of the realm of, poss of possibility depending on how well the nightclub does but yeah uh the colin robinson baby's kind of fucked up looking <laughs> i love it uh, I'm excited to see what they do with that character. I'm curious if it is just a little Colin Robinson or if it's going to be different, but only time will tell. But yeah, uh, I guess that's going to be it for now. Uh, if you enjoyed this reaction, hit that uh, like button. Uh, hit that subscribe button. It helps me out. It helps the channel. Uh, and it would be greatly appreciated. Uh, and until the next reaction video, uh, peace.